When it comes to money no object, just acquiring the world's most desirable tech isn't enough. You've got to make it pop. And there's only one way to do that, my friends, and that is gold. Gold. <laughs> This precious metal has always been the ultimate symbol of wealth, used on everything from statues to teeth. But it doesn't stop there. I was at the London HQ of Gold Genie, a company who have developed a way to gold plate the gadgets of the rich and famous. Laban. Yo, hey, Damon, man. I'm good. good I'm good. You. Thanks good for letting you. us come in. I'm going to ask you a really stupid question. Mm. What is Gold Genie? Well, Gold Genie is a customization company, and we customize luxury gifts, uh, mementos, personal mementos for people, like things like, you know, this flower, which is oh, a wow. real flower. There's a real um, flower in there. There's a real flower in here, man. Oh, wow. We were the first company to go play an iPhone. Who among your clientele would we class as celebrities? Who, who've been there? Um, Rihanna. We made a technical microphone. To, to Gold her. microphone. So, so yeah, wow. exactly the same microphone. We've done iPhones for Chris Brown, P. Diddy, uh, Denzel Washington. You don't just do gold no, anymore. No, we don't just do gold anymore. We do rose gold, uh, we do platinum, we do diamonds, like this Apple Watch. So, how much would this cost? This particular device on our website is £11,000. And they don't just work on little gadgets. For customers where money really is no object, Gold Genie will turn their hand to gold plating anything. The largest item that we've actually gold plated today has got to be the Neesden Temple. In, what? In, in Wembley. That's, yeah. a bu that's a building. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what we did, we did the dome, we did all the uh, artifacts uh, on the roofs. But as you go into the temple, there's like a 40 foot tower, yeah. which we gold plated. The, the weirdest request today has still got to be something a Brunei's toilet. That's not a dipping process, is it? Because obviously a, a, a toilet's yeah. big. Yeah, yeah. It, it was in situ, so we had to take our portable plating system, which we're going to show you. Over there. Yeah, and you know, I literally painstakingly gold plated. It took me a, probably about a day and a half to do it. Come on, who hasn't dreamt of a gold plated throne? Next, I wanted to see exactly how the gold plating process works, so we went downstairs to talk to Frank. So what is actually going on right now? He's deconstructed a, a, an iPad, but Well, this is it. actually... We're actually now reconstructing it. When we have an iPad, we take it apart. Uh, from that point, we, we're then able to use the housing to gold plate it and do our magic onto the house. Right. You're genuinely plating the existing skin. You're not just dipping the device. Some people think it's, this is just a case. Yes. Um, that you can just buy and then put the iPad or the iPhone into it. These aren't cases. These are the actual devices themselves. Yeah, so it's not something that can be scratched off or no. pulled off no. or anything like no. that. No. Next came the plating stage, which looked very low-tech by comparison. So what's he rubbing on it at the moment? This is real gold, 24 karat gold, held in suspension, gotcha. in liquid. Yep. And as soon as you run the current through it, yep. the gold is then deposited onto the spoon. Oh, it's turning gold! Wow! And it's instant. There's nothing on the paper, look! You can rub it as hard as you want, it will stay on there. I was keen to experience this wizardry for myself, but fresh out of iPhones and toilets, I had to settle for something more humble, a flash drive. So the first thing you do is you hold that against yep. the USB. Yep. This wire gave the USB drive a negative charge. Then I cleaned it so that the gold would stick perfectly. Once you finish that roll, you just spray deionized water. Yep. This rinses the device without affecting its electric charge. Plug in the, the gold probe. The liquid contains microscopic gold particles. The probe gives them a positive charge, which means they stick to the negatively charged USB stick. You can see as you're rubbing, you can see it turning to gold. Are you mad, mate? Are you mad? Look! Look at that! It's a gold flash drive! So, Frank, this was a £30 flash drive. How much do you reckon it's worth now? Um, we would put this on the website at about £299. Jeez! Look at that. Boing. So there you have it. If you want to stand out from the crowd and rub shoulders with film stars and sultans, giving your tech the gold treatment could be all the bling you'll need. Once upon a time, it was all about getting your hands on one of these. Now, you can gold plate anything, even one of these. Cheers, fellas. <sighs> Cheers, fellas. He ain't coming back, mate. A quarter of a million pounds just rode off. Frank, we've just been mugged off. 
You'll unlock the front door with something you'll never lose. Your palm. No more fumbling for keys. It's quite sensual. You can see how, with someone that you have feelings for, it is quite physical, that. 